Hello guys, welcome to my channel The Trend Diaries. This is Nidhi Jain signing in. So to get the look, we would start first by prepping our face with the aloe vera gel. I am using Patanjali's aloe vera gel. I personally do not like the silicone primers as I am having a sensitive skin. So I use the herbal aloe vera gel instead. So just dotting it on onto my face and then making upward motions with the help of my hands. Remember never use downward motions on your hand while using any of moisturizer, creams, lotions or anything because that would make the shadows fall downward onto your skin and you would look more aged because of that. So always make the shadows fall in upward way. So make upward motions while applying any kind of lotion onto your skin. So after we are done with that, just let it dry because the gel dries matte onto your skin and it is not at all oily or greasy which is why I love it a lot. So the next step what we gonna be doing is smiling. <laughs> Okay, so next I'm gonna be just hiding off the acne marks onto my forehead with the help of the Olivia Pan Stick. This is a creamy based foundation stick. So just applying minimal amount of it onto the acne marks and with the help of finger just dabbing it in. Uh, do not scrub it or drag it onto your skin just dab it lightly with the least pressure you can apply with your fingers and do not be hard onto your skin so just by dabbing motion dab 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 and the product goes into your skin hiding away all the flaws and the dark spots onto your forehead I'm having little bit on the temple region also so I'd be hiding those two the stick also dries matte being a creamy formula still it does not look a cream at all it dries matte onto your skin after the application this is why I love this product also okay so the next one what we'll be using is um, um what should we use next okay so first I'll do my eyes I'm gonna be doing the winged liner look today so with the help of lacme matte eyeliner I'm gonna be applying it onto my eyelids also in the morning I had applied some white kajal so just removing it off with the help of my hands and a straight drag onto your eyes without moving it so that the liner comes straight I give my hand support onto my uh, cheekbones so that my hand doesn't move and is stable so that I can literally just drag the liner across my eyelids without making it look shabby. So in just one stroke we are done and also lining properly the inner lines in the corners of my eye. And that wing liner look just extending off the liner and you're done the liners done all set just leave it off to dry matte next step are my eyebrows my eyebrows need a little bit of definition remember never used a uh, unsharpened pencil eyebrow pencil always sharpen your pencil each and every time you do your eyebrows so that you get nice precision and there are no harsh lines at all so with the help 
of the I I I I I I what? Okay, with the help of the eyebrow pencil, just with light hands, just go on filling any gaps into your eyebrows, and then with the help of this dual brush, which is having a comb on one side and a brush on the other side, just um drag through your eyebrows, just brush it off. so that no harsh lines are there onto your eyebrows and the product gets blended really well and no harsh lines seen so that it gives a real natural look i messed up somewhere over there near the tip of my eyebrow Don't worry we can any time fix it up with a concealer so you just find just do as you can if you are a beginner don't worry at all i just combed them up so that i could give a definition and that area near the high point of my eyebrow i messed up a little with the pencil so i'm going to hide it again with the olivia stick but this time not with the fingers with the help of a brush so that i can go really well for the precision and just brush it off like normally you can do and that excess of product is gone out it's gone you're done the excess product is hidden completely next I'm having so many of products lying in front of me. I'm just getting confused what to use. Okay, so let me think what next. Where is it? Where is it? Okay, so we'll go in with the blush palette. I'm having this blush palette as you can see. I've used almost of it. So which shade we'll be using today is the light pink one and with the help of a blush brush okay blush brush we're going to apply it the light pink one over there on the top just remember to tap off the brush so that you do not take any excess of the kya hai amazon hai kya ओके सो कंटिन्यूइंग विथ माई ब्लश मेकिंग दैट फिश फेस and just applying onto my apples and then just blending it off and with i just applied a little bit of highlighter on the high points of my face the nose bridge the upper cleft of my lips the chin and the beauty bones on my shoulder there where did my vaseline go who put that there okay so prepping my lips with vaseline first before applying the liquid lipstick as the liquid lipsticks are matte every time apply any kind of balm or moisturizing balm or whatever you have on your lips then i'll go for lining as i'm using a nude lipstick i'd be applying the same um, kind of shade for the liner as well next i'm using my mac vampify liquid lipstick for the look today i'll be applying the liquid lipstick with the help of the spatula kind of brush they've already given in it and using the tip of the brush and apply the liquid lipstick so that the liquid uh, lipstick 
as well as the liner you've applied beneath the liquid lipstick both blend out easily and give nice dimension to the lips never apply the line never uh, draw the liner onto your lips after the liquid lipstick is applied because that would not blend at all and it would look so shabby trust me so always apply it beneath your liquid lipstick and yeah just done you're done with it i'm done with the look completely this was a simple no foundation glowy look for the evening time i hope you guys liked it please subscribe to my channel if you like this grwm video please give it a big thumbs up also do not forget to subscribe to my channel the trend diary subscribe to my channel to get notified every time i upload a video please subscribe to my channel it's absolutely free